Arriving unannounced, the Home Secretary got straight into some samosas and discussions with Asian shopkeepers about immigration rules and the problems of running a business in Derby Road. Even we got the security alarms, we got the French shuttles, is it? But after all that, is it? We couldn't get the insurance, is it? So if you could kindly have a look into that, you know, for us, is it? You know, the broker should be able to find a firm who would. Well, in the end, he have tried. You have you have you found someone now? Well, um, it's not a hundred percent. He did find it, but it's uh, temporary covers, is it? And uh, uh, the premium is double than last times, is it? But we don't mind the premium because we didn't have much. No, but you uh, must have a cover. I mean, that's yes, very we, that, that's, thing, that's really yeah. upset us because, especially during the Christmas times, is it? Out on the street, Mr. Hurd was tackled on the government's reluctance to impose sanctions on South Africa. I am a Somali yes. person. I came from Somalia, and I'm a student, eh? and I support the ANC. I'm anti the British, what they are doing in South Africa. Well, I don't think you know you, what you are going supporting. To. You are supporting South Africa. <laughs> A few minutes later, when some ostentatious jewellery caught his eye, Mr. Hurd wished he hadn't inquired. I'm trying to read upside down what you've got. It's a Kruger round he's got. The Home Secretary was the guest of Portswood Police. The station has responsibility for a district where it's reckoned about 30 prostitutes work. The city council is trying to stop prostitutes using houses for entertaining their clients by imposing enforcement orders under planning regulations, and it's said to be working, while the police have the task of tackling the problem on the streets. What we're trying to do in Southampton and elsewhere is to bring together the efforts of the British, of the different departments, say the police, housing authority, education authority, social services department, so that in any given area where there's difficulty or discouragement, all the efforts work together.